I'm Mr. Tastic, and in this video art tutorial, we're going to be drawing a peacock. So grab something to draw with and something to color with, and let's make some art. This episode is brought to you by ArtasticKids.com. If you're a parent, guardian, homeschool family, or a classroom teacher looking for art lessons and resources, begin your journey by finding free art lessons, tips, advice, and more at ArtasticKids.com. All right, so we're going to be drawing a peacock. So here we go. We're going to begin with peacock's eyes. So we're going to draw one big circle. And in that circle, we're going to do one big circle and two small circles. And then you can go ahead and color in the dark of the eye, leaving those circles white. Around the eye, we're gonna draw a nice thin line curving around like that. Next, we're going to do a beak, so we're going to start off with a curving line. Tuck it down and bring it down like that. So it's kind of like a triangle, but curvy. Yeah. And we're going to add a nice little curving line just below. Of course, our peacock needs to breathe, so give it a nostril. You can add another eye just peeking out on the other side by drawing a half circle with one circle in the inside and color in the rest black. Leaving just that little circle nice and white. And of course it's gonna be smaller because it's going to appear that way to be farther away from the viewer because it's on the other side of the head. All right. We're gonna draw some curving lines here, curving parallel lines. And on the ends, we can add some circles. And then we can draw the head in between, just like that. All right, bring the body down, around and up. Nice big round shape there. We'll draw two curving lines on either side for the wings and tuck them down at the bottom. I like to add a couple U's in there just for some feather texture. And we can have some little peacock toes peeking out at the bottom. Next, we're gonna do peacock's tail. So we're gonna draw a nice big curving feathers, working our way around the body. Oops, I just cut part of my head there. That's okay. Add some little U's along the neck for some more feather texture. And then we can go ahead and draw one big circle at the top of each tail feather. And then in each of those, I like to add one more little circle. Just like that. You can add some zigzag lines down the side of the body. Again, for some feather texture. You can add a series of hatching lines and a few of the feathers on the tail for their texture there as well. And to add a little detail and flavor, of course. 
once you're done, you are ready to color it in. So grab your choice of colors. Go ahead and color it in using your favorite art making mediums. Once you're done, your lovely peacock is done. Well, that's it for this episode. Please make sure that you subscribe to the channel, Ms. Artastic. And if you create anything and share it online on social media, please, please, I would love to see it. So tag me at Ms. Artastic and I will check it out or join the community and conversation and use the hashtag, hashtag Ms. Artastic. And I will check it out that way as well. And 
you can see what other people are creating who create with Ms. Artastic YouTube videos. Well, that's it for this episode, and I will see you in the next.